So school's back in session, and a local company is looking to make a difference with a national campaign. Yeah, and Emily Beyer right now, she's in Nina with more on this event. Morning, Em. Hey guys, good morning everyone. So we are here at Jewelers Mutual Insurance Group. We are talking about the Give Back campaign. I'm actually joined by Tyler Crevice. Uh, tell us a little bit more why you guys wanted to get involved in this campaign. Yeah, this is a great opportunity for our company to give back to the community. The Kids in Need is one of three national charities that we're working with and um, we're packing up 2,000 backpacks today to give back to eight schools from Green Bay to Oshkosh to Nina to Appleton. And as you can see, we have employees here yeah. working feverishly to pack these up to yes. give back to this community in the next two days. Yeah. And they're very excited to be up here up and early, right guys? Yeah. <laughs> they're so excited to be a part of this. So tell me, why did you guys want to be a part of this and make have this kind of an impact? Well, we know there's a need right here in our community. Um, whether it be the first day of school or whether it be um, weeks from now or even months from now, we know that it may not always be for uh, easy for families to um, make ends meet or um, families may fall on hard times so um, we at Jewelers Mutual want to make sure that families right here in our community um, have less worries and um, that kids are able to focus on the right things and especially when it comes to school that they're able to focus on uh, school and not needing to worry about um, the backpack or the school supplies. Yeah and looking around at these guys they're having fun putting this together this is something great to be able to do for your community. It is. I mean, we've been based here in Nina, Wisconsin since our inception in 1913, and our employees um, come in from everywhere from Green Bay to Oshkosh and everywhere in between, and we want to support the communities that they're in. They feel passionately about the communities that they live and work, and we want to make sure that we're backing that up. Yeah, absolutely. And you guys, now here, I got to talk about this because this, are you ready? Are you ready to cry here this morning? So this is what they put in the backpacks. It's their final touch that they add to them. These are these little notes that they will add. You guys, let me just read you a couple. Brooke, are you ready for this? I know your kids just went back to school, so this is going to hurt, but you're amazing just the way you are. You were made to be awesome. These are all just great things that are going to inspire these kids as they go back to school and they have no worries because they got everything they need. So just a great story happening here today. You guys will send it back to you. All right, thank you so much, Emily. Very touching. Those notes do add that extra little touch for those kids. Do you put them in your kid's backpack on occasion? Sometimes in their lunch boxes. Yeah. Oh, cool.